Now the next tool I want to show you is the arc tool and how you can use arcs to get nice drawings. So this right here is actually the page from an old book from the 1700s and you can see it's a diagram of an old book stand. So you can see this is pretty much how they did technical drawings back in the day. But you can see different types of stands that are meant to hold books. So right here it's French, different types of stands and their developments. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at this piece right here and see how they used arcs to create these types of curves up the top here. So we have our piece right here and you can see I'm doing this in a part and not in the drawing and that way we can actually take a look at what this would be like in three dimensional. So let's zoom in up at the top here and I'm editing this part it works the exact same way as editing drawings in the drawing tool. So I want to right click. Why is this not working? There you go. Edit sketch. So you see this toolbar up the top here is the exact same as it is in the drawings tab. So let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of this, and let's use the arc tool. So if I zoom in, I can click here to here and see that that's part of a circle. I can click here and here to see that that's part of a circle. I can click here to let's, say, let's split this one in half, make that one. And let's drop this one down to right there. So that matches that one pretty nicely. This one right here looks like it's two big circles. So if I take this line, so if I take this line right here, you'll notice that curve crosses right in the middle of that line. So let's know that these are two circles. So that's a circle that's a circle. The shape right here is actually it's called an OG. It's a classic thing you'll see in a lot of old-time furniture and designs. So now let's take our line, draw a line down here so we can use the mirror tool. And let's just highlight these curves. And I'm holding down shift, shift down. And I want to mirror it over this line. Hit apply. And that should have copied it all over. And done. Now you see my lines are a little bit off from my original drawing. So you can see that those aren't really connected. So we can just fix that if we wanted to. Delete that line. Grab another arc there to there. Close that off. This one down here. Line to line. Let's trim this middle line. And finish sketch. Bam. So you can see we have some beautiful curves that match our original drawing.